So I went down to the starting the 07, but which I didn't, a lot of these I didn't even know. I ain't never heard the I Smell Panties EP. <laughs> I feel like Tyler. <laughs> <laughs> no, me. That's what it's called. I miss Tyler's that somehow. So, as Tyler's well. so funny. <laughs> I, I feel like we got to start with Yonkers. Man, Yonkers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yonkers is fire. I'm going to go off. He did the I Future Till tape. this day. I don't feel like he's probably going to have a lot, though, that's outside nah, of himself, really. though, right? Nah. So he did the Odd Future tape back in. AC Veggies. 08, Casey Veggies. Uh, he did, let's see. Brandon Deshay. Okay. Um, he, had, he had his little run. Haji Beats, who's a part of, um, part of Odd Future as well. Okay. Earl Sweatshirt as well. Domo Genesis, who is as well. The Jet Age of Tomorrow. That's, I remember that, but I don't remember that. Yeah, I don't remember that. Bush. Goblin. Goblin was dope. He, a lot of Casey Veggies. Frank Ocean. The Internet. Yeah, the, the internet. internet. That's dope. It's not really hip hop though. Mm, no. Unfortunately. Channel Orange. Got a joint on there. Yeah, not hip hop. Mac Miller. Yeah. Watching movies with the sound off. Schoolboy Q Oxymoron. Mm. That counts. Yeah. Um a lot of cake. He produced his whole wolf album. He does all his albums. That's that's crazy. Blank face. Blank that face. That was uh I didn't know he did. Oh boy. That. He did yeah, that, he that did. joint is hard. Not not all of them. Well, that's just the the LP. I don't know what he did off that. Oh, I thought you were saying he did the title no, no, track. No, no. Blank I was about, that, the, yeah, that these are just albums. These are projects he's a part of. Uh, yeah. Solange, Solange's uh, When I Get Home. Great album. West Side Guns, Pray for Paris. Mm. Good to see Snow Allegra. Table. Snow Allegra. Oh, I got him backwards. You're right. Uh, temporary Highs in the Violet, uh, Violet Skies. Maxo Cream. Says is uh, control. So those are some of the ones. So anyways, if you want to go. Do you want to go through some of these records? Or? Well, it's just um, I'm seeing a lot of production on his solo albums where it looks like he's doing the majority of yeah, that, all of them he's doing he's, which i'm impressed with he's got a hand on everything yeah <laughs> I'm, I'm impressed with i'm really impressed he with know that. how to play keys yeah he, he get busy in there all that all that he's a uh, student of uh for real definitely the push T joint oh i think it's called old with um haji beats yeah party Thank with you. pop smoke he did that one off pray for paris okay I don't Let's remember see. that. Yeah, that was dope. That's yeah, when I, the, uh, I, the Pray for Paris might up. be my favorite yeah. West Side Gun. Yeah, record. I remember you talking about it. He's got a new one coming out too. Yeah, pretty soon. He did a Neon Peach and In the Moment off Snow Allegra's album. Mm. School Boy Q to Purge. Um, Matt Martians. Didn't just say and calling on me. The whole Cherry Bomb album. Big Body from Skip School Boy Q. Oh, he did. I didn't know he did that for. Uh, the doors from Mac Miller. That song is cold. Remember it? Yeah, Optimum. I didn't know he, it's the intro. That song is cold. I didn't know he did that. That's impressive. Uh, he okay. did blank face. He did okay off watches movies with the sound off. I remember that one. Flower uh, Boy was dope. Did the whole thing. Garbage from Grand Theft Auto. Olive Wolf. You know, yeah. I'm impressed at the fact that he did all of his, the majority of all of his projects. Yeah, he did a, a whole uh, Doctor Seuss. Um, Little set, you know he did that. Bruh. The Grinch, Lilo F's Stitch off I Smell Panties. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a Tyler song, Jerry, doesn't you it? You heard that EP? You just want you just want to say I smell panties again on there. Yeah. I smell panties. Oh my god, that's not how the song goes. I, I know it don't sound like that. You could, who knows? Good. Uh, let's see. Goblin, Yonkers. Yeah. you know all that stuff. Yeah, I think we got enough, right? Yeah, that's heat. All that is heat. Yeah. I guess I should pull it up. <laughs> All right, now well, let's do it. Ain't no, I ain't know she has as much heat as she does. Oh, she's fire. Who? Oh, Snow Lurker? Yeah, she's yep. fire. She's heat. Yeah, don't do that. Impact on peers and uncomping purpursers. I'm giving him a nine for that one. Oh, what? <laughs> purpursers. Purpursers. Okay. Yeah. What is Tyler's impact influence? Uh, I'm gonna go like six. six. I'm gonna give him a six. I'll I, give him nine for I'm, that. That's a little high for me. I'm gonna go seven. Yeah, it's a little high for me. I think he impacted a whole subculture, which turned into a main culture. I just don't know who any of those people are. Yeah, well. I mean, I'm sure we will see that. Mm-hmm. No, I, I, feel like, I feel like he will, like, I can't eventually. Pick him out now. But for right now? Yeah, I can't know, pick I, him I'm out I'm sorry, I give him six. No, yeah. I definitely could see that, though. I, I see him having a, a very uh, Pharrell-like influence. Versatility. He's very versatile. I'll give him a seven. Uh, I'm going to go eight. He's very versatile. Yeah, I'll give him a, I'll give him a seven. You said eight, Jay? I said seven. Seven. Mike, you said eight. Yeah, I'm eight. Yeah. He's very versatile. Hmm. Yeah, I think eight is fair. Collaborators, different hip hop styles of artists. 
Uh, that might get him a little bit. Neat. Am I tripping? Hip hop wise? I mean, uh, Mac, Haji, Pusha T. Pusha T. Uh, Snow Allegra. They sound different. Cool boy. Cool boy Q. I got to give him a seven there. I Se- actually got to give him an eight on the influence. I'm with, Jay, I'm, I'm, I'm with Jay Moore on the seven for this one. Seven. Yeah, yeah I'm going to go, I'm gonna go seven, on this seven as well, I think. Pretty consistent with the types of people he works with, which yeah. isn't necessarily a bad thing. Hit making, big hits, cult classics. Mm. Four. Whoa. Six. Six. Yeah. I know his records, but if you're not a fan. Cult, though. Yeah, I mean, that's cult. That kind of buys into cult a little bit. Yeah, I fall into the cult. Um, drinking the Kool Aid, huh? I still, I stick with my four. This one is tough because I because I, like I once again he's got cult it's cult classics and big hits or he's or got, or, big, or he's or, got hits. Yeah, I mean or. he's got uh, he's got Grammys. Uh, five, yeah, five, 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 five. Okay, five. It's definitely four to five. Yeah, the cult classics was to to make sure to throw that in there just so yeah that, yeah just no, yeah. I feel you. I'm gonna go. <laughs> said drinking the Kool Aid. I it's petty. I'm probably gonna do six. I feel like Yonkers is like man yeah, when that nice. came out was pretty pretty. But that's the one that I I can't really think of any other ones that are like super. I mean, he has records. Don't get me wrong, but no, he's got joints. But to be fair, I think I think we all in the same area. I think we in the ballpark. Mm-hmm. It's fair. Consistency of quality material released. Hey, hey I'm giving him a nine. I give him an eight. He's consistent. I'm giving him a nine. I think he's worked up to the nine. Yeah. yeah. I'm giving him a nine. He's not somebody that has fallen off. He's definitely not there. Uh, body of work? Man. Off his albums alone, eight. throwing in what he's done, I'm going to go nine. I'm a legit fan of dude. I'm, I'm, I'm trying not to be biased, but he's, he's, he puts out high quality material back to back to back. What'd you say? What, what's, what's, what's Body of work? Seven. I think I'm going to have to go seven as well, though. Um, some of his older I'm stuff, not I'm not a huge. I feel like he's growing to that, but I don't think he's always been. He kind of hit his stride with Flower Boy. Yeah. Final product. How often are the songs great from Tyler Production? Nine. Uh, he he's songs are you know for whatever. I I feel like the songs are great. So he makes dope nine. records, yeah. man. He makes dope records. I I'll follow I follow Jay Moore with that. He makes dope records. I give him a nine on that. Um. If I'm spanning his entire discog, I have to can't go higher than an eight. Eight, okay. Melodic elements. Eight. I listen to his pro. I, li- I listen to his production a lot. Um, I'm gonna go ten. Ooh, I'm gonna Dude, give him there's an eight. Mad, there's mad layers in his music, man. I'm he's, giving him an he's eight. He's dope. He's dope. Yeah, I was. I, I think I'm gonna go nine because I was thinking nine or ten as well. He's dope. He's dope at that. Drum programming. I mean. He's there. Eight. It's there. Eight. Eight. There. Seven. Mm. Mm. Yeah, no. We'll be missing. I, I can do eight, Terry. What did you say, Terry? All right. Seven. That is a high score. 7.7. Somebody going to be mad. Somebody going to be mad, mad, mad. You got one point more than Noah. Noah had bad. Noah, Noah had so many hit records, though, man. It was... Well, didn't, that's, we, didn't we give him? That's 10? why there's so many categories. You know, like you can say, "Hey, we you were better than him here," but like over here, nope. You got ten like down Noah the line in hit making. And, sure did. And yep. I threw a four in there. Yeah, yeah. And he still he still ended up wow higher than Missy, higher than Missy. 